Daniel here for Tabletop for One. Please join me at the table as I unbox Cristallo. And I thank you very much for joining me on Tabletop for One for this unboxing of Cristallo. It's an award-winning puzzle card game that is solo only, although I guess you can play with more players. It plays in about 30 minutes. Now, this has been very popular among those solo players who own this. I haven't seen it available in very many places, but recently in Barnes & Noble, I saw this available. and they So they have a Barnes & Noble exclusive edition that comes with an extra card. And so in Cristallo, you explore the lair of the Black Dragon in search of treasure, free the six mystic creatures, and trap the dragon in its lair. Cristallo is a puzzle card game that can be played with friends or solo. So you combine crystals, free the mystical creature, and trap the black dragon. And here's ratings on interaction, strategy, luck, and difficulty. There's even a watch it play tutorial. Looks like Dice Tower has awarded it, so it looks really good. I like the box. I like the, the clear picture here with the gems. Go ahead and check it out. Oh wow, check that out. Little cover for the insert. And so these gems are standard acrylic gems that we see in a lot of board games. I still love them though, even though I see them all the time. I, I love the look and feel of these gems. And these four colors are very vibrant, so really nice. All right, let's see what's in the bag. Okay, we have the rule book, a deck of cards, along with the extra card, and a bunch more of those gems. So I'll set those aside, we've already seen those. And so let's check out the rule book. So here are the components here. 54 cards and 18 gems. It explains the story again. There's card types and terms. So crystals, orbs, creature card versus cavern card. Explains an overview of play phases. And then the setup here to play. Making crystal sets, freeing the creatures. Collecting treasures, trapping the black dragon setup, and trapping the black dragon in detail here. We also have titles, a scoring table, and then you can keep track of the titles you earn and who did what and what treasure you got and all that. So there's a log in the back for that. All right, so we got this deck of cards. As I'm opening this here, please hit the like and subscribe if you would, if you like the content you see here. Okay, so we have a variety of crystal cards here, a player aid card, and then the creature cards. So we'll check these out. First of all, for those of you who own the game and are wondering what the extra card is, here it is. It's a special treasure card that says, add this card to the cavern deck for a slightly easier game. It may be counted toward any one treasure set. So it doesn't look like it changes the gameplay much, it just makes it slightly easier. All right, so let's go ahead and check out the creature cards. Look at the art, that's really nice. The Firefox, the Phoenix. Also has symbols for each of the different kinds of creatures here. The Unicorn, the Ice Wolf, Seahorse, the Fairy, and the Black Dragon. <laughs> Comes in two pieces, you gotta put it together. <laughs> That's great. And I don't know if you can see, but they got a little shiny element to each of the creatures there. It's really nice. I like the quality. All right, and so here are the cards. I'm not going to go through all these because they're pretty much the same thing. Some of them show treasure on them. Others are just crystals. But... Definitely looks like a really fun game. Reminds me of other puzzle games like maybe Sprawlopolis or Grove or Orchard, those kinds of games. And so there you have it. That has been an unboxing of Cristallo, the solo award-winning puzzle card game. Stay tuned and for future playthroughs of this game. I will do at least one playthrough and uh, most likely a review at a later time. Also go check it out at Barnes & Noble. Uh, I guess that's where you're going to find it if you're going to be looking for it. Feel free to ask me any questions in the comments below. And I thank you very much for watching Tabletop for One. Have a great night.